Hi, I'm Dave Robinson. I'm an ex-parent and uh, I taught at Chilton Edge for over 30 years until I retired last year. I'm totally behind the campaign to keep Chilton Edge open for a number of reasons. The main one, we believe Chilton Edge has the capacity to improve. Under new leadership and an academy sponsor, this school can get back to where it was five years ago when Ofsted rated as good. We are totally against the, uh, the potential closure. It's not just the parents who are saying that. It's not just the 2,039 people who've signed the online petition. It's not just the hundreds of parents who are supporting the Facebook campaign. It's even people like the Parish Council of Sonning Common who are meeting on Monday evening to debate a motion in support of Chilton Edge and keeping Chilton Edge open. Because the Parish Council of Sonning Common recognised the devastating effect it would have on the community. Not just children, not just young people, but old people who use, the Chil uh, use Chilton Edge for various, various facilities. So, and it's not just the parents, it's not just the online petition people, it's not just the Facebook campaign, it's the two MPs directly concerned. Rob Wilson, the MP for Reading East, has publicly come out and said he's a against closure. He's been up to the school, he's met the school council. John Howell, the MP for Chiltern Edge, the MP for Chiltern Edge in the Henley constituency has come out and said he is against closure. That should convince Oxfordshire County Council to seriously listen to what we've got to say, stop the consultation, actively seek an academy sponsor, get in a new leadership in Chilton Edge and let's get the school up and running as it was a Why few don't years you want ago. Chilton Edge to close? Because it's like a big family community and everyone knows each other so it's like a big family really. So what is it you like so much about Chilton Edge? Um, it's a welcoming school, anytime you're feeling down all the old people were there for you in your form and it's nice. supposed to go up in September. Yeah. What, why, why did you choose Chilton Edge? Well, my uncle went there, my mum went there and my brother went there and my, and my brother's now like working really high at technology so I'll leave the car shop. Yeah. Hi, uh, my name is Gemma, I'm an ex-Chilton Edge people and my son is currently in year 11 about to start his exams on Monday. <laughs> um, Chilton Edge is a good school. I had an excellent experience there. My son has enjoyed the last five years and done really, really well. And I think it's really important to save this small community. School. Hi, my name is Trassa Walsh. I have two ch children currently at Children Edge. I've got one daughter who's been through the system of Children Edge and now successfully she's in uh, Birmingham University thanks to Children Edge. I think it's really important that we all join this fight. Personally, because I obviously have two children there, but it's going to affect the community and all the surrounding schools, not just within South Oxfordshire, but also Reading Borough Council, because the majority of the children that go to Children Edge are from, are from Reading. Where are they going to be put? We know all the schools are full. Hi, I'm David. Um, I've got children at Children Edge. Um, I'm here campaigning to keep the school open. There's already a lack of school places for secondary school children in Reading area, so it's a ridiculous decision to even consider closing Children Edge. So we're here campaigning and asking Oxfordshire County Council to do the right thing, the sensible thing and the only thing, keep the school open. Hi, I'm Gemma Levy and the reason we need everyone in the whole community to sign the Oxfordshire County Council consultation form is to prove to Oxfordshire that the whole community wants to save Chiltern Edge School.